Did you know that the average U.S. consumer eats a total of 46 pounds of fresh and processed Apple products every year? There is a wide assortment of products available under the Lucky Leaf and Muscleman's brands, which can be used for many menu applications. The versatility of these Apple products make them ideal for any day or menu part. Today I'm going to highlight three applications that are sure to be patron pleasers. Smoothies are a nutritious breakfast treat or on-the-go beverage any time of the day. This is a spiced apple smoothie. We use cinnamon applesauce, but you can use any flavor of Musselman's applesauce. Yogurt. This is vanilla yogurt. You can use plain or any other flavored. Wheat germ. Banana. And Musselman's apple juice. Finish it with a little ice. And here I have a little apple pie spice. You can use pumpkin pie spice or cinnamon. And give it a whirl. This is the spiced apple smoothie. Finished with a little of the apple pie spice. To make a trio of smoothies, try on apple berry plus shake with applesauce, apple juice, frozen apple berry blend, banana, and flaxseed oil. The Harvest Blend Shake has applesauce, apple juice, frozen cranberries, ground cinnamon, nutmeg, and vanilla nonfat yogurt. With beverages covered, it's time to turn to the center of the plate. Looking for a flavorful addition to any protein? These oven caramelized Lucky Leaf apple slices are finished with apple juice, a touch of balsamic vinegar, and demi-glaze sauce, and simmered to meld all of the flavors. We show it finished here with pork, but try it also with chicken, duck, or lamb. This is seasonal vegetable soup. I saute onions, add carrots, or any other seasonal vegetable. Could be acorn squash, parsnips, rutabaga, turnips, cauliflower, you name it, whatever seasonal. Add some potatoes to add the velvetiness to the texture of the soup. Pour in some Musselman's applesauce. And what's nice about the apple flavor, it adds a little sweetness to the mixture, really accents the vegetables beautifully. Add apple juice and chicken stock. Take it to the stove, simmer it until all the vegetables are tender, and then puree the soup. And it's ready to plate. You can serve this cold or hot. With the carrots, it's quite beautiful. And I'm using yogurt to garnish. and a few chives, and that's the finished plate.